sensor over here. Okay, so this is good. Mm -hmm. So, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, here there are a couple of improvements. First of the first improvement is the overall graphic of the top picture, because I've seen, uh, let me quickly check over here. Yeah, the prices are quite high. They are high ticket products. So definitely, I will definitely focus on improving the overall design of the top picture and these ones. And uh, this one, uh, it's uh, okay. This can be okay because the product is very technical. The feature product, I will probably move over here on top. Uh, and uh, I will add uh, the, a section either if you were featured somewhere or uh, if you were in some, uh, mm, I don't know, some... Uh, like some YouTube videos, if you got invited, like this section would be very important. And yeah, here I will definitely add many other things uh, like uh, to allow like the best sellers, the contact us, uh, all this information. Then you hear the newsletter, I will definitely focus on doing something more unique and grow the list. So definitely gives be very clear of the benefits of joining the list because you want to have a strong backend, especially if you're selling such a high ticket product. So you want to send a lot of educational content and a lot of product aware content in order to educate the people, the subscribers about uh, the product that you're selling. So I will really, really be clear on that, uh, highlight it and really put it as a top priority to grow your list. And of course, also with a pop-up. In this case, I will focus a lot on the content and exclusivity. You can even test an incentive like 10% off, but usually for this type of products might not be the best option. So yeah, these are some things. Uh, like I don't, I don't see a blog section over here, which will be very useful as well. Uh, like this, uh, I don't know, like... For the, for example, in my case, but I think many other people uh, would agree that it's not clear what that means. So to add something over here. And yes, if there are some testimonials, of course, to add them on the bottom. And uh, yeah, so these are some things that I will definitely uh, try to improve. Try to improve for uh, for this brand. Let me check the products over here. So let me take, for example, this one. Okay. Okay, so yeah, is the main issue here for it to, is the lack of information. There should be a much more detailed section where it explains the features, the benefits, who is this for, why it's unique and uh, yeah all this information is plenty of copy and we'll focus on some videos like short videos the youtube can be good but uh, yeah this one for example 16 seconds i'll also add them over here and yeah to, the idea is to really give as many info as possible uh, in this case the price uh, uh, is very high so many people might have a lot of objections i will include definitely a q a over here as well, QA about this specific product, that would be something uh, to do as well. So, the add to cart, let's see over here. So, okay, maybe in this case, one thing that you can do is to either add a section here you might also like, or to launch like a limited one time offer over here, for example, with a countdown with uh, five minutes saying, hey, I have this product, uh, like if you buy this product with this one, you will get a special price, a complimentary product, but this offer is only available for five minutes. That's something that you can do as well. The checkout uh, over here, let me quickly check how it's going to look like. 
Okay, so here I will also add, uh, if possible, uh, PayPal, Google Pay, and uh, Amazon Pay, like adding those other uh, uh, payment options can be a great way. Here is not, this should be on, because otherwise almost no one will click over here, so you won't be able to collect the emails. And as I mentioned to the other brands, like always try to add here a benefit. Again, the idea is really to uh, collect the, the email addresses and grow your email list, your backend, because many of the people that will check your products, they might not be able to uh, buy right away because of either lack of information or because of the price or because they're not sure if it's a good option. So what you want to do is to grow your list, send a welcome flow where you give as much info as possible about the specific products and uh, like uh, all the info like uh, i will definitely focus on overcoming objections content so this is one thing i will also focus on uh, really make them first of, uh, first of problem aware so to create content to highlight the problem that they might have if they don't have your product uh, then solution aware, so you give the options out there. And, and then the product aware, like to make them more aware about the product. So highlight many features which are unique, uh, many benefits, uh, clear benefits. Uh, and yeah, this is what I will do. And then really try to see which, uh, uh, which incentive can be good for them. Try to collect data as well to use surveys. Uh, uh, and ask questions in the service to say, uh, for example, uh, why, like for the people who didn't buy yet, but they went through the flow, the welcome flow, uh, why you didn't buy from us, you know, like what's the main reason why you didn't buy from us and collect those data and then uh, uh, see like what you need to change. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. This, of course, I will make them also bigger. But again, the idea here is to really focus more on uh, uh, the design. I will definitely change a bit the layout here. 